recreational. Each has its own set of rules, but that could change. And change in a big way. Washington lawmakers are considering a bill that would regulate medical marijuana the same way recreational pot is regulated. It's something medical marijuana users have feared all along. And KXY4's Alyssa Donovan working for you on Senate Bill 5052. So Alyssa, what does this mean for medical marijuana users? Well, essentially, Nadine, what would happen is the Liquor Control Board would be regulating medical marijuana sales similar to the way they're uh, regulating the recreational marijuana sales. Now, so far, this bill has a lot of support from legislators. However, medical marijuana users and medical marijuana dispensaries are not on board with these implementing changes. There's no reason getting involved in it and trying to mess it up, leave it the way it is. That's what Darren McRae has to say to the lawmakers working to pass this bill. He not only uses marijuana to treat rheumatoid arthritis, he also owns a dispensary. But at a public hearing in Olympia today, there was clear support for some type of licensing to medical marijuana. Recreational users or the recreational sale of marijuana are subject to the regulations adopted by the Liquor Control Board. There are no equivalent regulations for the medical market. And who regulates the medical market? The medical market is not regulated. You heard right. The industry is not at all regulated. The Cannabis Patient Protection Act would change that. It would require state quality testing of marijuana and reduce the amount of cannabis that can be grown in a person's home. Patients today are permitted 15 plants and 24 ounces. Possession limits will be um, six plants unless a health care provider believes that in their professional opinion they could qualify for up to 15 plants. But McRae says that amount is not enough. It's not enough medicine to keep them medicated over their three months. The bill would also cost McRae what he says is 80 percent of his sales. No more dried marijuana, only edibles and oils instead. There's a lot of medicine in a flower that's not carried over to the oil they're going to limit us to be able to carry would be oil and medibles. Now the bill calls for medical dispensaries like Spokanabis uh, to be licensed under the recreational system. Dispensaries worry it will drive up their prices, reducing access and putting them out of business. Alyssa, recreational pot, as we know, heavily taxed, bringing in millions of dollars to the state of Washington. Will patients uh, who use medical marijuana uh, have to pay a lot more if this bill passes? Well, Nadine, that is a concern because dispensaries don't want to limit their patients' access to marijuana. However, patients will be able to access a waiver that will make them tax exempt, and we will let you know what happens with this bill. Reporting in Spokane, Alyssa Donovan, KXLY4 News.